So if you've never made artichokes before, which I'm sure some of you have, but I like to cut these little tips off so they don't cut your fingers. You know, I cut the ends off and I hold on to it with the little end. And then what I do is I take my handy dandy knife and I just cut the end right off. And I cut that end off too. And we just go right down the center. Boom, like that. The only thing you gotta do now is see this part right here? This is the stuff you don't wanna eat right here because that's all the little hairy things and the super pointy stuff. So we're just gonna grab our little knife, cut right in there with the tip. We're gonna go right along the edge, the bottom there. And then you gotta be careful with your fingers, but you're gonna go in here, spread that open a little bit. You're gonna grab these guys and you're just gonna pull them out. Boom, just like that, you pull that out. You don't wanna leave any of these little hairs. So get your knife, cut that stuff out. So let me go over to the sink here and we're just gonna rinse it. We wanna clean it as much as possible. And we're gonna do that with all of the artichoke. Okay, so I got those all cleaned up and ready to go. More butter, gotta like butter. Happy garlic, you wanna get a bunch of garlic. I'm gonna chop that up nice and fine. Dump that in there. Let's get our butter. I've got a whole cube of butter. So I'm gonna stick that in the microwave for about a minute or so. Mix that stuff together. Yeah, look at that, see? And you can smell that garlic in there, right? So that's done, that's ready. Now I'm gonna show you how to assemble these bad boys, okay? Bring them over here, and we'll just do one at a time. So we grab one of these guys, and we just set it down. And we just pour a little bit of this butter on there, put some of that garlic in the center, because that's where you're gonna want the garlic. So you put the garlic in there, and then you pour just a little bit of butter in there, like that. Take a little salt, a little kosher salt, not a lot. We're gonna do a little bit of pepper, and I like Italian seasoning, you know? You just put a little bit of Italian seasoning on top, then what we do is we wrap it up, just like so. You wrap it, you roll it, take the end, crimp that up, so that way there's no air getting out, okay? And boom, there, you have one. So there, we got all four of these ready to go on the grill. So I've got my temperature at about 375, got them all prepped up, I'm gonna stick them on the grill, and I'm gonna stick them on top. So for about 45 minutes to an hour, we're gonna let those go. And look at that madness. Look at that artichoke. Ooh, it's hot. Cut that bad boy in half like so. And you dump that on top of it. It'll still taste good no matter what. But the lemon really makes it. 